guys. It's early morning. I'm on the Outer Banks of North Carolina on the beach. The sun is rising behind me. And I'll see if I can work a little uh, gray line DX this morning. Stick around. Beautiful morning here in Nags Head, North Carolina. I gotta get out here on the beach before all the tourists did. And uh, here's the setup today. Gonna be using my uh, Zygu G90, little uh, LiPo 4 or 6 amp hour battery, short piece of coax over to a 49 to 1 with a choke. That's a 1 to 1 choke there, and I'm a 41. 49 to 1 un un from uh, Tintanas. That is an awesome un un. It's amazing. And uh, my 10 meter Expedition DX Commander pole with some 16 gauge wire cut for a half wave of 20 meters, somewhere around 14 to 40. So this is a vertical in fed half wave one quick little thing you see i choked it that is a one about a one meter long counterpoise wire what that is is that's five percent of a wavelength for 20 meters so that's going to act as my counter and i'm going to get out here and see if i can work some dx this time of morning usually for me gets me to the west not over to europe Although I was looking at the cluster, it seems like there's some U.S. and Europe stuff going on. But uh, here we go with an in-fed vertical half wave. Let's uh, see if we can work some DX here. So this is the Southern Cross net. It's one of the reasons why I come out here on Saturday morning. Uh, Saturday mornings I get on here quite frequently. It's about uh, 6.45 a.m. Eastern time here in the States. And it's really... Uh, Right around this, I'm at 14,238 right now, but anywhere between 14,238 and 14,240, usually in the mornings here in the USA, it's a pipeline to the DK, and that's why I'm here. I've got the power turned down to uh, 10 watts, so we're going to work a little QRP. QSL, QSL, I'm portable, QRP on the beach in the Outer Banks of North Carolina. Portable, QRP. Hey, thanks for taking the call there. VK6 Radio Charlie, Kilo 4 Oscar Golf. Oscar, I'm 10 watts, 10 watts portable QRP on the beach in North Carolina. Hey, thanks for the 4x1 into Perth here. Glad to make it. I've got a vertical, a half wave vertical for 20 meters, so about a 10 meter long wire up on a DX Commander pole vertical right by the ocean here, right by the Atlantic Ocean. Yeah, you would Hey, sorry about that. You're 5'8". Wonderful audio. 5'8 here. Yeah, 5'8". Uh, Hey, got you there, but someone uh, stepped on the end there. I got Victor Kilo 4. Can you finish the call? Thank you there, VK4, BOB Portable. Thanks for the portable to portable uh, contact this morning. Thanks so much for the uh, for the flowers there on the video channel too as well there. Hey, 
at QSL. QSL, you're about a, a five by two, five by two here on the beach. I've got someone uh, real close to us here that's giving us a little QRM there as well, but uh, I got you there loud and clear. Hey, thank you so much there, 73. Here's a good, uh, you see the metal detector behind me? <laughs> Let him get on down the beach. It's interesting, isn't it? Shows you that something's happening here with the ground. Copy, copy, uh, VK4KA, Kilo 4 Oscar, Golf Oscar, QRP on the beach there. Lovely signal here. You're about a 5'9 this morning. Yeah, no worries at all, Walt. Well, yeah, you're about 5 and 5 with me, 55, and I'm only running 100 watts as well. So uh, if I'm 5 over 9 plus at Shack uh, to see what the, uh, uh, what the amplifier is going to do tonight. Uh, Jack, you're, uh, you're 30 over the beach. I'm sure it's back and through here. Good job. I was down here a couple of nights ago, and I did, uh, I did spend all night. And, uh, and I was working in the UK until about, uh, it was about uh, 17 to which is two, 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 three o'clock in the morning or something in the short part. Uh, guys in the UK were five and nine, five and nine plus, so really good uh, pair they've been getting. But uh, good to hear anyway, well, I'll get my report, I am, uh, and I'm going to go back up the house as a I just covered it, I just happened to check my phone uh, when I was sending a message on the, uh, when I saw your message. Uh, Kilo 4 off your gold box, your VK 4 KA over. Hey, QSL, Corey, QSL here. Yeah, I got down here, and I, actually the uh, conditions, uh, you guys are starting to come in a lot better here. The sun's up now and uh, a little bit better. There is an Italian on 14239 right now that's causing some QRM. But, uh, yeah, very, very lovely signal, Corey. It's so good to get you here and uh, get you on the net there. I always look for you. You know that when I get out here on a on a uh, Saturday morning and it's Saturday evening there. Love, lovely to talk to you guys there. Anyway, thanks for coming back, Corey. Uh, VK4KA, uh, Kilo 4, Oscar Golf Oscar. All the best, my friend, 73. Yeah, how are you doing, Walt? And uh, yeah, you enjoy and have fun with your operations. Uh, thanks very much, Jack. I do appreciate it. And uh, good evening to, uh, to, good morning to you too, Gary. I did hear you there as well. Uh, N3SJL on the group, VK4KA. Well, that's a lot of fun. I like to do that um, and get out here. When I, when I could hear the BK, I figured, you know, I'd start at 10 and QRP and, and then go up to 20 if, uh, if I needed to. But I stayed at 10 watts the whole time, so uh, great, a great QRP context. My friend uh, Corey, BK4KA. I message him all the time. When I get out here, you'll, you've probably seen him in a lot of my videos. We kind of uh, go back and forth a little bit. And he's he's got an amazing antenna. He's got a Moxon, and uh, man, he can hear me, and he sounds amazing all the time here. So uh, really good. I messaged him and said, "Hey, I'm on the uh, Southern Cross net," and he came over. That was pretty cool uh, to uh, make a contact there again with my friend Corey. But anyway, hey. That just shows you get up early in the morning and uh, get get in the right situation here on the uh, on the Atlantic side, the East Coast of the United States, and probably across the country, really. But uh, as the gray line's coming in, uh, working VK right now this time of year is just it's it's wonderful. It's a lot of fun. I, I think what I'll do now is I'm going to show you the I didn't show you this at the beginning of the video. I'll show you the setup, the new setup, the, the way I'm I'm mounting this. Uh, 10 meter uh, DX commander pole into the uh, in the sand. I'll give you a quick rundown on that and then I'll, I'll get out of here. Okay, what I've got is a, that is an inch and a quarter PVC pipe. I'm gonna take the antenna off. You'll see how I mounted it. I took the bottom, I took the bottom of the uh, DX commander, the screw off bottom off and slid it on the pipe. That's about a 30 millimeter uh, PVC, a schedule 40 PVC pipe. I'm gonna pop it off here real quick and show you how easy this is. That simple. I kind of hack jobbed it on the end there. I'd say it's about a meter long, a little over a meter long, maybe a meter and I don't know, maybe 40, 50 centimeters. But anyway, that's the new setup. It works great. Hey guys, thanks for uh, thanks
Thanks for watching the video. Thanks for watching me uh, have some fun on the beach here on the Outer Banks of North Carolina. If you enjoyed it, hey, please like and subscribe. Till next time, I'm Walt K4 OGO 73, my friends.